the light for above the little back bed that folds out and I'll show you how to do that next. Okay. Um, and this is going to be your main monitor panel. This is where you're going to check all your tanks. This is where you're going to turn your hot water heater on. Okay. Um, this is going to turn on our water pump. So if we're just running off of your fresh water tank, mm -hmm. that's going to give us our water pressure. So whenever you're running off of the fresh water tank, you're going to want to turn that water pump on. Now, if you're at an RV park and you're hooked up to a city water supply, that's going to provide your pressure. So you won't need the water pump for that. What it'll do is it'll pull from that tank and from the city water supply and just run your tank out with, when it doesn't need to be. So this is going to turn your hot water heater on. You either have gas or electric. So if you're dry camping, you'll probably want to use gas. If you're at an RV park, use electric. It's going to save your propane. Mm -hmm. um, it usually takes about 15, 20 minutes to heat up a full tank of um, water. Okay. Now just be aware of this light right here. This is our DSI fault. That's for your propane side of it. So for some reason the propane side of the hot water heater did not light up. What will happen is this red light will come on. Check your propane. Make sure you have propane in the system. Make sure your propane's turned on. Turn it off for about 10 seconds and then fire it up again. Um, you can also just do the electric side and just hit that switch on like that. It takes a little bit longer, but it will heat the water about the same time. Okay. And I'll let that heat up for now. So to check your tanks and your battery, what you'll want to do is just push and hold that. So our battery's charging right now and it's showing full, which is probably full now. And then when it gets down to E, it's going to light up just one dot here. Um, fresh water tank, I filled that up, but we tested the system a little bit. so. It's about two-thirds now. The black tank is going to be just your toilet water. Um, that's your waste tank for the toilet water. And then the gray is going to be your sink and shower water. So when these get full all the way up to the full line, that's when you're going to want to dump your tanks. Okay. All right. Now this is going to turn your thermostat on and off for your heat. So there's a switch right here. Either goes to the right or to the left. All the way to the right turns it off and give it about maybe 30 seconds to respond and that heat will go off. And to turn it on, just pop that to the left here and then you can adjust your temperature accordingly. Okay. Um, this was going to run off of um, just regular 12 volt battery and propane so you don't have to be plugged in in order for the heat to work. Um, closet space back here. Um, this does fold